Welcome back to the Directing Design YouTube. This is part two of our three-part series where we're going to dive into how to use Notebook LM and to convert our research into a study guide and a podcast. What if your notes could think for you? In Notebook LM, we can turn research into summaries, flashcards, and even a podcast instantly. Let's jump over to Notebook LM and see how this is done in a few easy steps. Step one, log in to Notebook LM and upload the materials you want to analyze. Log in. So here we are at notebooklm.google.com and you can see a few projects that I've worked on before. The first thing we're gonna do, step one, is to upload our research. I'm gonna create a new project and it's gonna prompt me where I want to get my source material from. In this case, I'm going to upload a file because I downloaded it from Perplexity when we were doing research in Perplexity. So we give it a few moments and it's going to summarize our article. In this case, I was looking at what the latest trends in mental health therapy were. Now from here, we have summary and on the right hand side we can create a study guide and we can also generate the podcast so here it's creating our study guide we can also ask questions about the content that we've uploaded so we can try something like summarize the document in five bullet points Amazing. We can also create study guide and if we go back to the studio we can generate a conversation in the form of a podcast. Step two. Review the documents and the outline and ask questions. This is where you can see just how magic this tool can be, especially if you're trying to learn content, whether it's uh, research or materials for work, or you're studying mathematics, science, or a language. And step three, now you do the magic where you turn everything into a podcast and you can even interrupt the podcast to ask the presenters a question about the materials. Welcome to the deep dive, where we cut through the noise and get straight to the insights. Today we're jumping into, well, a really fascinating deep dive on the mental health therapy landscape looking ahead to 2025. Things are changing incredibly fast, and uh, our mission here is to pull out what's truly new and impactful from the sources you've shared. But we're talking... So let's fast forward it a little bit. Powerful, yeah, for efficiency and training. But I guess it raises that question about the human touch in therapy, doesn't it? It does. Are the sources talking about how AI fits with empathy and connection rather than replacing it? Or, you know, ethical concern? That's a... So also while it's playing, there's an interactive mode where I can stop and ask questions. You can also download the podcast so that you can use it on your phone, listen to it in the car, uh, and just use it at your convenience. So let's try asking a question a really valid point and yeah the sources are pretty careful to stress that Welcome to the deep dive where we cut through the noise and get straight to the insights. Today we're jumping into well, a really fascinating deep dive on the mental health therapy landscape. Look Oh hey there, what's up? Hey, I just wanted to ask you a question. Do you think that there's a stigma attached to mental health and getting appropriate treatment for mental health disorders. That is such a crucial question and thank you for asking it. It really ties into everything we're gonna discuss. Absolutely, it's a foundational issue actually. While our sources for today's deep dive focus on future trends, the very existence of these advancements implies a shift. What's fascinating here. Hopefully you can see just how powerful this tool is. 
I really hope that you enjoyed this short informative video about how to use Notebook LM and take your research to create study guides and a podcast. Please subscribe and stay tuned for part three, where we look at taking the same research materials and turn it into an amazing presentation using gamma.app. Tata for news.